Glenn Clark with Connor Walsh after Stevenson's season finale. Connor, I know this is not the way that you wanted things to go. Um, are you able to take a minute and sit back and reflect on the season that you're able to spend here, the memories that you made, and how much it means to you? Absolutely. Um, first off, I just want to thank Coach Stewart, Coach Jeff, Coach Selby for, for the opportunity. Um, it was a long four years of playing football, and I missed basketball a lot. And they, uh, they took a chance on me, and I'll always remember that, and I appreciate the opportunity. Obviously, right now, for everyone, it's, it's disappointing. Um, we really thought that any given night we could be any team, and I still, I still th think, think we can. Um, just, uh, just thinking about it, it was tough. Tonight was tough. Every single game we felt like we were in it, and they just punched us at the end, and, and that, that hurts. But um, I'm, I'm walking away with a smile on my face, for sure. The people I met at this program, at this school, um, everyone just took me in with, with opening arms and, and a warm welcome, and I always remember this opportunity. So for me, um, definitely sad, but I'm walking away with a smile after the people I met here. Is there any particular moment, you know, whether it was a win you guys had or, or something, or maybe something that happened away from the, the court that you just say, I know 20 years from now, I'm going to remember that, I'm going to think about it, it's going to be something that will mean something to me for as long as I'm alive. It's, it, it's going to have to be uh, the, the 6 a.m. wake-up calls for in September, <laughs> run, running the miles, and I was, I was running more long distance to try to get in shape, and we started running the miles, and that was a rude awakening for me that I needed to get quicker in that, in that aspect. Um, I think just every individual, it, it's hard to name one moment, but I'll definitely remember each individual on the team and each coach because of a relationship that they were able to build uh, with me and I was able to build with them. Um, and this, like, like I told all of them, this is a, a for life thing, as we say. So it's for life. Um, I'm just super, ha super happy to have met these guys. I mean, what's the message that you see? The guys that are going to be you know, coming back here and trying to build off of this foundation, what is it that you would want to say to them and, and how they take this forward and use this moving forward to get Stevens and to make sure that next year they're not feeling the same type right. of heartbreak? Right. It's... um. Just stay connected as a unit. Uh, work even harder. I think they got so many bright pieces. And just to point out, Nate, I call him Mongoose. Yeah. He, he's just a beast in there. He's going to be really good at this program. They got great pieces like Cam Sapp, uh, Ryan, Nick, Kyle. I mean, all, all the guys, Brian, everybody. Um, they, they got a lot of bright pieces. Stay connected. Um, just work even harder. You know, you always think you've worked enough, and there's always a guy out working you. Um, so that's, that's my message to them. Connor, it was a lot of fun to watch you play this year, man. I'm, I'm sorry that it ends this way, but I uh, really appreciate you spending time with us, and we wish you the absolute best as you move forward, all right? Thank you very much. I appreciate it all. It's Connor Walsh. I'm Glenn Clark. Go Mustang Sports TV.